there's supposed to be a back of sand. Stand here and die. But I think the game is bugged. <sighs> Frick. Can I restart the game? How do I go back to main menu? Can I please go? Oh god, look at all the text. I need to get back to the main menu because I think the game is bugged. There we go. Let's, let's try the last checkpoint first, but... I would break the game! Locked off. Now I have to find another way into the diner. Well, at least now we got time to do it after that. I'm so glad to see you, sweetie. Are you okay? Where's Chloe? Yes. What about you guys? Two whales is barely standing now. I don't know if it's gonna make it through this tornado. Oh, poor Officer Barry and all those people out there. Okay, get your ass inside. I have to get back to this gentleman on the ground. Lauren has been gathering all the first aid. It's not much, Joyce, but it's all we have. You okay, Warren? How the hell did I ignore all those warnings, Max? The snow? The eclipse? There's nothing you could do about it, Warren. I'm so stupid. Should have seen it coming. I saw it coming and I still couldn't stop it. So Hello. glad everybody is safe here. But I need that photo from Warren to help Chloe. Sorry, sorry. I do, but I can talk to Okay, you? Max. Excuse me while I go help this other gentleman. You're gonna Frank, I'm so glad you're here. Yeah, it makes two of us. Now, if only I had Rachel back. Oh, now, Max, oh, what about that info I gave you? Did you and Chloe find out what happened to her? God, you're not gonna be happy. Oh, Frank. I don't know how to say this, so... I just will. Rachel is dead. God, no, please. Please, no, no, not Rachel. She can't fucking be. Are you, are you, are you sure? I mean, how do you know? We used the names you gave us to track down a farmhouse. My professor, Mark Jefferson, has this creepy photo torture room. And we found out he was using Nathan Prescott to drug and photograph Blackwell students. Prescott? Fuck! Fuck, I knew it! I should never have hooked up with that sick punk. Papadou hated him. Yeah. You saw. You saw Rachel. Yeah. Yes. 
I wish I didn't. I'm so, so sorry, Frank. Nathan wanted to impress Jefferson, and he... he killed her. How? Hmm. Oh, How did he kill her? He used some drug and gave her an overdose. An overdose? The only way Nathan could have done that is... is if I sold it to him. And you did. I killed my lioness. No. What have I done? Where is this motherfucker Jefferson? He's dead. Oh, yeah, dead. He won't be hurting anybody anymore. Rachel. Oh, God. She was the one good thing in my life, Max. I know she was too young. I expect her to leave me. Just... It's not how it happened. I would never have stopped her from going after her dreams. I know. She obviously cared about you, Frank. Well, Rachel cared about a lot of people. Especially Chloe. But, uh... Now I see why Rachel dug her. And Chloe was man enough to ask me for help after all that shit we went through. Chloe would appreciate that. You know, the one time I met my dad, the bastard quoted the Bible and said he wanted to enter his house justified. In other words, to do the right thing. Me too. And maybe you're helping me get there, Max. Don't get me wrong, kid. I still think you're weird. But you're cool. Max, do Max, you... I, I do you think believe this is reach. the end? I, I can't talk right now, all right? Talk to Rachel, but I got uh, Rachel Warren. I meant, uh, but I, I don't want to touch this guy. Jesus, face, this is not Are where I want to die. Pompadour, you're okay. At least Frank still has Pompadour at his side. I wish I could pet you, but you're probably not gonna let me. Warren, buddy. I hate to say I'm glad to see you, but I am so glad to see you. That's okay. The important thing is that you're safe. And I know you can take care of yourself after Nathan. Should have done that a long time ago. But damn, Max. Can't believe you actually drove down here in the middle of a fucking E6 tornado. Just for one photograph? I mean, there's a story. No, you didn't come that. for me. Warren, I came for all of you. Just tell me you do have the photograph. I just want... Now shut up and listen. Oh, yeah. Bruh. You're finally going to tell me what you never did in the parking lot. I wish I would have. So I'm just going to tell you without any explanation. Trust me, okay? Oh. I always do. You should probably tell me quick. I had a vision in Jefferson's class of a tornado destroying Arcadia Bay. I went to the bathroom and saw my best friend Chloe get shot by Nathan Prescott. You with me so far? Where else could I be? Go on. <laughs> then I found out that I could rewind time. And long story short, Mark Jefferson is insane and dangerous. Whoa. Is that all? Kill Chloe, you start. I started to start. Whoa. Did I? I don't. I have to go back in time. Jefferson already the mouse killed on Chloe. Again. I can't let that happen. I have to do something, Warren. Max, going back in time is what caused the storm. All oh, because... because of me? How? I'm not a real scientist. Breaking the game, Even though man. I play one at school, but this seems like pure cause and effect. Maybe chaos theory. What happened with Jefferson? Did... did he hurt you? He used Nathan to get drugs and money for him. Jefferson tied me up. She's so broken. Dosed me with some drug and took sick photos of me. It was so horrible. Max, I'm so sorry you had to go through all that. You're the bravest person I've ever known. 
You know, I want to kill that son of a bitch. Where is he? Jefferson Dead. Is done. History, which I need to change fast to make it right again. Is that bad? For every action, there's there's a reaction. Whenever you reverse or or alter time, maybe you cause a chain reaction. Even in the environment. You're my friend, Warren. You believe me, right? I, I don't know. I haven't told anybody else except for Chloe, and and she can't help me right now. I know I can be a pain in the ass, and and you've always treated me like a person, not not a beta nerd. I I told you before that I'll always believe you. I just wish I could trust my powers. I guess we'll never know if it's magic or science, even if it's from a wizard or a wormhole. You're part of something bigger. I don't believe in fate or destiny, but after this week, I realize I don't know shit. That makes both of us, Warren. I do know you're here for a reason. And I guess it's up to you to find out why. Max, I'm sorry you got stuck in this. In this, I don't have a fucking clue what's going on. But I have total faith that you'll do the right thing when the time comes. I'm so proud of you, Max. How could there be a more important moment in history? And I'm in the middle of it with you? So thank you for trusting me. Thanks for being here. Warren. Always. Thanks for the photo. Come on, Joyce. Focus on the people here. What? That's it. I was just about to drive that, to Los that's Angeles, it. too. Frick. Hey, be careful out there. Hug, kiss, like, I'm gonna kiss him. Kiss him. For luck. <laughs> he deserves so much. Just in more. case we don't get out of this. I wanted to say. I know, Lauren. Of course you do. I'm right. going to make the right choices from now on. I swear. That's why you're super max. He's so sad. Thank you, Warren. This is taking us back towards the Vortex Club. We can still save Victoria, too. Somehow, maybe. Have you been drinking? God, how are we gonna fix all this? We gotta save Victoria. We got Can we save Nathan? We got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. <sighs> Chloe! Jesus, dude, what is up with you? I'm just glad we're here together. I guess you need to talk. No worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right no, now. No, no, no. Sorry, no, no, no. we're in. To Rachel. Let's go. Now. Chloe, wait, listen. I can walk and listen, okay? Stop and listen for once. Fine, Max. I'm listening. There's Chloe, a lot. You can't go in that party. You're going to. You're gonna die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's I... no way that punk-ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me down. You're right, he won't. Mark Jefferson killed you. And others. Jefferson, the art teacher? That's bullshit. Nathan is the fucking serial killer. Oh, we saw that. the proof. Now excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Nathan is dead. Nathan is dead, and you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? How do you know that? Because I was there. Will you please tell me exactly what happened? Please. If you're gonna listen to me. Oh, God. Um... Jefferson kidnapped Rachel and some other girls. He was also manipulating Nathan, and he killed him. Then it's Jefferson's turn to die now. 
I, agree. I understand why you don't want to do this, and I won't blame you for not coming with me. No. Chloe! No. 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 If I'm totally no. strong no. and honest, she'll listen. I'm her best friend. Excuse me. Nathan's dead. Nathan is right. dead. That fucker is. Because. Will you please. Chloe. Jefferson drugged and kidnapped me. I was tied up in his bunker. You have no idea what hell I went through to get back here. But I couldn't let you die. You brought me back here, and I can't lose you again. I won't. Uh, Max, I'm, I'm so sorry. I was the one who dragged you into all this shit. Nobody, especially you, should have to go through that. I... Now we have to stop Jefferson. Okay. With one bullet. No, not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if all I'm gonna do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is gonna turn out, and I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? What do you mean, Max? What did you do? A whole lot. I fucked up, Chloe. I wanted to make things right, but everything turned out wrong. Max, what the hell are you talking about? Back in time? I, I, I was able again. to go back in time to the last day William was alive. Oh, well, there's that. I stopped him from leaving, but... But you ended up in a car crash instead. You saw my dad again? You... You were completely paralyzed. And... You, you were in pain. You were slowly dying, and you... You asked me to end your life. I did. For you, I, I didn't want you to suffer in any other timeline or reality. I, I, I couldn't bear the thought of you in any more pain. God, Max. That must have been... That must have been awful for you. I'm, I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen, and as usual, I messed everything up, and... I never want to hurt you. Ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. Do you think I would even know how to handle that situation? Nobody would. The important thing is that we're together again. You're right. That's... That's why you should come with me, so we can stay together. And... Stay alive. I hear you, Max, but do you think we should let Jefferson get away with torture and murder? Of course no. not. If we tell David, he'll believe us and he can actually stop him. Right? I don't get it. Why do you trust him after you totally reamed him the other day? He's not even at our house anymore. I mean, Chloe, yeah. David saved me from Jefferson. If he didn't track down the dark room, I'd be dead right now. Max, I had no clue. I should have been the one to save you, but I'm so grateful David was there. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been through so much. I, I believe you, Max. After all, I'm still your faithful companion. Yes, you are. So listen, in a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now. Just explain that I traveled through time using the photo. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. God, I hope he finds Victoria, though, alive and fine. Okay, they did find her. But did they rescue Victoria? Oh, Chloe! I 
see that the real Max is back. So, how was your time trip, dude? Shut oh. up. Oh, you're alive. You're alive. Oh, both of us. You have a very good problem. so much to bring you back home. It worked. Actually, it worked. You're with me again. <laughs> Looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And travel through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over and... I hope it was worth it. I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life after all my drama. Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. Just look at what my powers have caused in just a short time. Nobody. You're Max fucking Caulfield, time warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. Nobody. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I willed it subconsciously to myself. I always wanted my life to be special. An adventure. But not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So, without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. And for whatever scientific, mystical reason that we'll obviously never figure out. We were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes, fighting for justice. I'd like to think that too. We all owe Rachel Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. You you remember, right? Well, we we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't find us. For once, I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. Then the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe at the lighthouse. Oh, hey, look. The storm is getting bigger now. It's coming closer. Oh, I, I can't even believe this is real. This is happening because of me. Stop it. Is this, stop beating yourself up, okay? We both paid our dues already on it. God, look at that. Look at that monster. Who knows? This could be Rachel's revenge. Our revenge. The lighthouse is out of the way of the tornado. Come on! Ooh. Chloe. I've got your back, Max. Uh, oh no. Whoa. Alfred Hitchcock famously called film Little Pieces of Time. Uh, I'm back in class. What the hell? <laughs> These pieces of time can frame us in our glory and our I have to listen to this Jefferson lecture again. <laughs> this might be hell. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly this captured is messed the condition in black and white? Am I stuck in a time loop? Anybody? Bueller? Diane Arbus. Be calm and go, don't Bueller. freak out. Why Arbus? Yet. Because of her images of hopeless faces. I feel like totally haunted uh, by the eyes of those uh, sad uh, mothers and children. She saw humanity as torture. What's going on? And frankly, it's bullshit. Nobody even cares? Shh, shh, shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. I'm not looking out the window. I'm here. Oh, hello? Everybody's gone now. Have I totally fucked up time? This doesn't make sense. Okay. I see you, Max Caulfield. What? Don't <laughs> even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. You weren't there two seconds ago. I just Where's wanted to know quiet? if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Your purity that... inspires me so much, and we could be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? Nope. There's no way I'm saying that. No way. Uh, oh my god. I don't like any of these options. My selfies are shit. I need to be framed by a real artist. I'm just a poser. Yes. You will be posing. Okay, For me. I hate this. There's so many angles I want to expose you with to the world. I hope you don't mind I'm needles or duct tape. Eyes. Okay, bye. This I'm can't out. be real. 
We broke something. I don't believe it. Max, why did you stop me from jumping? What kind of friend are you? You never understood me, or what happened to me. Now my family will never leave me alone, and that means I'll always be alone. Thanks to you. Kate, that's not true. I've always been your friend. Okay. Oh no. Can I literally open all of these? Oh boy. I hate that. Oh, oh. Well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I give you the keys to my RV I don't know where that's coming from. I just got my. Did that say key? It did say key. 218. Okay, we're going to try to get those keys. 21. Thank you. Thank you. I Are these Rachel? Yep. Oh god, there's no keys of Rachel. Rachel. She, she was my angel. After my dad died and he moved, I felt abandoned. Rachel changed my life. So Rachel took my place. I'm glad she was there for you. Six months ago. She just left her video without a word. Where do I go? Without me. How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. Rachel, 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 Calm yourself, right? It was a gift. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been Am I just going to have to guess what door I got to go into? She had, has a great eye for images. Are you going to help me? <gasps> Rachel's room is 224. Okay. Plus, she's a smart ass like you. We would all be one of the best friends forever. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. There it is. Sounds like we totally crushed on her. Oh, now I'm Victoria. That's creepy. Do I gotta go to my own room? Two twenty one. Oh, yikes. Oh, Lord. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choice. Two twenty one. Do you think it's like fake we're not supposed to be friends? Two twenty two. Now what do you want me to do? Go to my own room? 